Rasa introducing legends of Indian mathematics. Aryabhata Aryabhata was one of the greatest mathematicians and astronomers from the classical era in India. Aryabhata lived during the golden period in Indian history from 476 AD to 550 AD. Some archaeological evidences suggest that he came from present-day Kodungallur, the historical capital of Tiruvanchikulam of ancient Kerala. Later on, for advanced studies, he went to Kusumapura, present-day Patna. He was the head of an institution at Kusumapura and is believed to be the head of the astronomical observatory in Nalanda University. Aribadiya, a compendium of mathematics and astronomy, is a magnum opus of Aribata. It gives light into concepts of mensurations, arithmetic and geometric progressions through Ganita, one of the three sections, and Aryasiddhanta is his another work, a law's work on astronomical computations. Aribata was the one who first came up with the concept of zero, though he did not use a simple for that and to this day the number system owes the recognition to him and also the place value system. He also calculated the value of pi up to four decimal places. He gave the solution to the variant equation. He is also credited with talking about trigonometry having discovered the cos and sine values. He also gave the algorithms for computing square and cubic roots using the decimal number system. In an era where science and technology were almost nil, this legend Aryabhata's contributions to Indian mathematics and astronomy is worth its weight in gold. India honored this genius by naming its first satellite after him and releasing a two rupee note and a postage stamp. Overall, it must be said that Aryabhata is believed to have died around 550 AD. He has left a fantastic legacy to be sure. Brahma Gupta, the great Indian mathematician and astronomer, is born in 598 AD at Bhinmal in Rajasthan. He became the head of the astronomical observatory at Ujjain in central India. Durkhiminarda, Kandakadhyaka, Brahmasvada Siddhantam, and Kathamikala are the four books ordered by this legend. Brahma Fuda Siddhantam, the corrected treatise of Brahma, is a well-known work among these. Brahma Gupta was the first person in history to use zero as a number and define the properties of zero, although his understanding of division by zero was incomplete. He introduced the concept of negative numbers and established rules for working with positive and negative numbers. He was the first to discover the formula for solving quadratic equation and came up with an algorithm for square roots. He gave the area of a triangle and introduced the formula for cyclic quadrilaterals. He gave the value of pi as the square root of 10. His contributions to astronomy include calculating the position of heavenly bodies over time, their rising and setting, conjunctions and the calculation of solar and lunar eclipses. Brahma Gupta died in 668 AD in Ujjain. He was honored by the title Ganita Chakra Chudamani, meaning the gem of the circle of mathematicians by a fellow scientist. Bhaskara I Bhaskara, commonly called Bhaskara I, was born in 600 CE. He acquired knowledge in astronomy from his father. Later on, he joined the astronomical school of Aryabhata. Bhaskara is considered the most critical scholar of Aryabhata's astronomical school. He gave a unique and remarkable rational approximation of sine function in his commentary on Aryabhata's work. In this commentary, Aryabhatiya Bhashya is amongst the oldest known prose works in Sanskrit on mathematics and astronomy. He also authored the books Mahabhaskariya and Lagubhaskariya. Parts of Mahabhaskariya were later translated into Arabic. Bhaskara was the first to write numbers in Hindu decimal system with a circle for the zero. 
before Bhaskara, the numbers were written not in figures but words. He gave the relations between sine and cosine, the relation between the sine of an angle greater than 90, greater than 180 or greater than 270 to the sine of an angle less than 90 was also given. Bhaskara dealt with the assertion that if P is a prime number, then 1 plus P minus 1 factorial is divisible by P, now known as Wilson's theorem. He stated theorems about the solutions of today's so-called Bell equation. He was the first to use primary numerals in a scientific contribution to Sanskrit. He has contributed to the study of fractions as well. The Indian Space Research Organization honored him by launching Bhaskara 1, a satellite on 7th July 1979. He departed this world in 680 CE, leaving a great legacy.